What is this place? These tunnels are ancient and familiar. They were built by the people who built me. Who was that? Do you remember them? No. The memories are fragmented, obscured. All I remember clearly is the order my creators gave me. Everything else about them has... faded. How unfortunate. Still, we must press on. Well, let's keep an eye out as we go through. Maybe we'll find some clues. Crisbell, what do you want to do? Nothing for now. do. Should I press this button? Let's try it. Thank you. 
dead end. Impossible. The architects who built this place surely had a way to cross. Perhaps the command console can be used to control the systems dispensing the lava. Any luck, magic robot man? <laughs> what? Hmm? I am not magic. That said, yes. It appears we can use this system to control the flow of the lava. I may be able to get it to work. It is done. I got access to the main pipeline. Restricting the lava flow. Yeah! Lava flow! Nowhere to go! Lost in the... What? You guys are all so serious. Sheesh. Isabel, what do you want to do? Nothing for now. You again! Why? Why are you always in my way? Stop, Kari! Hasn't there already been enough death? That's the difference between us, Saz. You could always let things go, forgive and forget. Not me, though. I'll never forget! Doesn't matter who gets in my way. Prepare yourself, sister.
It doesn't matter. It's already too late. What do you think she means? I'm not sure. Let's head inside the cathedral and see what we can find. Wait, Crisbell! This seems dangerous. Are you sure you did everything you had to do? It 
happened again, didn't it, Crispell? The cathedral awoke something deep within you. Yes, I... Oh, it has a certain beauty that's quite captivating, doesn't it? Well, my ride has arrived. Perhaps we'll meet again in Crystallis. See you soon. Polina's shoe! We barely made it back to town! The shoe? Thank goodness for Crispell. If she hadn't stopped time, that lava wave would have buried us all! Regarding the lava wave, it appears to have resumed its motion. It is currently headed towards the town. What... what is going on here? Miss Fenia, I know this is going to sound hard to believe, but the Millennium Rock, it was actually a giant egg! Wait! Listen! The Empress used the Millennium Flower on it, and it hatched. It broke apart, and a real-life dragon came out of it. Ha! Huh. I told you that rock looked strange. Ah, the Master Detective returns. The falling pieces caused a huge magma wave, and it's coming right for us. Everyone in Cinder and Sinisa is in danger! What? We have to start evacuating people. Galley, stay here in Cinder. I'll head to Sinisa. There's no time for more explanations. What should we do, Crispell? We need to make a decision now. We have to evacuate the city. It's the only way. We'll save as many as we can. <gasps> I'll help too! Best move fast. There's no time to waste. Come on, all of you! You have to move! The lava wave is coming! Volcano, we have to go! If we stay any longer... <coughs> We're... <clears throat> I'm sorry, Princess. We're not strong enough to make it. Just leave us, please. <sighs> we were... going to die anyways. Like hell I'm leaving you here! You're coming with me if I have to carry you all out on my back! We lost so many. Much of the city was destroyed. Where... Where's Volcano? Volcano! Volcano! Where are you? Answer me! Sister! I... I tried to tell her to leave, but she wouldn't abandon the six Sindarians. The lava wave. I'm so sorry, Callie. She didn't make it out in time. That... that can't be true. Volcano, she was smart. She was... invincible. My sister's not dead. She's fine. You'll see. You'll all see. Callie... Don't! Don't even talk to me. I'm going to go find her. You will just... leave me alone! With that dragon at her command, it's only a matter of time until Crystallis falls. The war is about to be over. 
So, what do we do? We have to stop her. There's no more time. We have to head to Crystallis and defeat her before it's too late. Well, I'm coming with you. Don't even try to stop me. Wouldn't dream of it. To be honest, we can use all the help we can get. Crystallis is north of here. Steal your hearts, young warriors. me you'll put it into whatever she wants to do we will miss Fenia. i promise what was all that ruckus over there i had to move out of the way when i saw a wave of molten lava coming towards me and don't make me start on that giant flying lizard. I'm sorry, Paulina, but it's time for us to go save the world. Such big plans. Sounds like you're finally getting serious. How can I help? Guys, I realize I'm new and all, but that giant lady is speaking. And where's her other shoe? Paulina, we could use your assistance in getting to Crystallis. The Empress has a new pet dragon. The city won't last for long. Oh my, that sounds dreadful. Also, she has a giant's bow on her head! Has anyone else seen this? Should I be worried? I love your new companion's fashion sense. The whole one-leg-covered thing is very trendy. All right, my little friends, I'll take you there. Anything is better than this heat. It's been a long time since I was in Crystallis. I suspect, unfortunately, it is now a city under siege. So many innocent lives at risk. This is even worse than last time. Last time? Never mind. There are people we need to protect. That's all. I thought I could help the people of Cinder, but I couldn't even save the city. How can I hope to save Crystallis? Or to stop the cataclysm. Remember your lessons. Even as time mages, there are limits on what we can accomplish. I'm not sure we can defeat the Empress either, but that doesn't mean we shouldn't try. It's not about only fighting the battles we are certain we're going to win. It's about recognizing that your powers alone can't always solve everything. In Cinder, your power wasn't enough to save the city itself. How could it be? But we all pitched in and helped. And people are alive today because of it. Remember, Crispell, you're not alone. I had not seen a dragon in over a thousand years. I believe them to be extinct. A thousand years? How old are you? I am 3,721 years old as of yesterday. Yesterday? So, happy birthday! Thank you, but please do not tell the others. I would rather avoid any potential singing. Of all human habits, spontaneous singing is one of the worst. What's it like to be 3,000 years old? It is life. That is all. I have nothing else with which to compare it. Still, in all that time, the things you must have seen, must have learned. Perhaps. Yet in over three millennia, I have not answered the most important question. Why am I here? What is my purpose? As much as I have seen, I am no closer to understanding that than I was 3,000 years ago. That said, there is one thing I can say for certain. In these past few weeks, since I have met all of you, I have done more living than in the entire thousand years prior.
my dad tried to talk me out of leaving St. Clarity. He said I had no idea what I was getting myself into. You know? After all this time, I finally decided he was right. Do you regret it? Coming on this adventure with me, I mean? What? No, of course not. That's not what I mean. It's just... Uh, the world is so big, you know? There's so much more to it than I realized. All the anger... All the hate I felt over my brother. Now... I don't know. It somehow seems so... Small. Compared to everything else we've seen. That must sound stupid. It sounds to me like you've grown up a lot. Never. I'm still a kid at heart. But... Maybe my focus has shifted. I don't think it's about revenge anymore. It's more like... I want to make sure a bunch of other kids don't wind up like me. You know? to roam around. We need to reach Crystallis as soon as possible. Why not get some sleep? We will be in Crystallis by morning. 